Well, good morning. I'm Scott Gabber with the Purdue Extension Office here in Shelby County, Indiana. And this is June 5th, 2018, 11 o'clock in the morning. This is your weekly crop update. Again, we're at the on-farm research trial of uh, Ken Simpson here in uh, just south of Morristown, Indiana. The corn right now is at uh, V8 or the eighth color and the beans right across the lane is at the second trifoliate. And that's a pretty good synopsis of the rest of the county. We have some corn that is already uh, at the 10th collar in the county, and we have some other corn that still is only at the uh, third or fourth collar. So this field's pretty much right dab in the middle, and that's, and that's probably where it needs to be. The uh, beans would be the same thing where most of our beans, well, I'm going to say all of our beans in Shelby County are up unless someone had uh, equipment breakdown, that type of thing, hardship that's going on. But the, all the crop in Shelby County is pretty much planted up and going. We had about two tenths of a rain last week, but it was very spotty. Some parts of the county didn't get it at all. And of course, you can tell from the wind right now, it's again this week windy and it's extremely dry. The humidity yesterday was only about 28%. And so it feels more like western Oklahoma this time of year than it does central Indiana. So with that, our wheat is now turning and we'll look to probably be harvesting that in the next uh, two to three weeks. Hopefully today we'll be able to do some aerial shots at another field too as well, looking at um, some of the dry conditions in the area and how that's affecting some of the corn growth and potentially some sulfur and other issues going on as well. For that I want to thank you for this week's crop update and we'll see you next week.